Hey, uh, first of the year, we'd love to do prayer walks. Prayer walks is a great opportunity to bring in the community, uh, to bring in your churches, reach out people, uh, some of the people that you might not uh, have reached before, and also open those doors uh, where people feel that, that when you say it's open door policy, it really is an open door policy. They also will start bringing in cakes, refreshments. They'll think of you during Christmas. They'll think of uh, the teachers during teacher appreciation and a great way to get some mentors. Also, while you're prayer walking, you can start looking around your campus and find something that guarantees on your campus right now, and it's called wasp nests. So we'll, we'll look up. You see one of the large wasp nests we found? We've already killed the wasp, but there's nothing worse than starting the first day of school or the first week of school and having about 10 students uh, hit by yellow jackets and having to call those parents. So I hope this will be an encouragement to you. Have a great first day of school and a wonderful first week of school. Be blessed. Hi, I'm Greta Jackson, principal of Villa Rican Middle School, and this is my back to school advice. V, verify that everything is ready to go. R, reflect on your goals for the year. M, make sure everyone feels welcome and S, put students first. Hi, my name is Shelly Hester. I'm the new principal at Sharp Creek Elementary School. If I had to give any advice for the beginning of the school year, I would say make sure you know how to phone a friend. Make sure that you are able to get in touch with the other principals that are in your cluster so that you can ask them important questions when you have them. If you're elementary school, make sure that you can get in touch with Jennifer Shirley. She does have a Facebook page, an email address, a text message number, and a cell phone number. So make sure you can get in touch with her. and Make sure she becomes your very best friend. It isn't what we say or think that defines us, but what we do. Mount Zion High School and in, and in the Mount Zion Cluster each year, we start off with a breakfast with the elementary, middle school, and high school. And it's a great time for everyone to meet the new teachers, but also for the teachers just to have a little social time before we begin a, a new year. Each year, we also have a video that we share with them. Last year, our theme was What Starts Here Changes the World. And this year, our theme is be, be the Path Changer. To get ready for the new school year, one of the things we do is we get our teachers and volunteers to come the week before the kids come back to help prune the bushes, to get the property ready, so that things look really sharp for the first day of school. 